Yeah, really interesting his perspective on all of this. So take a look at this. These are new sketches convicted serial killer Samuel Little drew for the FBI telling agents these are some of the 90 victims he convinced to, convin confessed a killing from 1970 to 2005. But the forensic sketch artist I talked to admits this is bizarre, but it could help identify these women. Started drawing people. I always like drawing people. Some police work is more of a fine art. It's not a quick process. No, it's not a quick process. Goodyear police detective James Weege has been a forensic sketch artist for over a decade. Sometimes a person will remember their eyes more specifically than anything else, or they will re remember the shape of the head. And while he likes to draw people, he never thought nearly a hundred of his portraits would be of criminals. But these sketches of victims depict a much bigger and bizarre picture. I've never seen it in my experience. No, I have not. Convicted serial killer Samuel Little drew these sketches of a handful of his victims for the FBI. These two women, he says, are from Phoenix. Weege says if Little spent enough time with his victims before he killed them, there could be some validity to facial features he would remember. I think there were just bits and parts that were a little random, but it does look like he has some ability to to render a face that's for sure he says the huge difference between little sketches and his own sketches is the process in creating them well see see the thing is when you can do a composite sketch you're actually interviewing somebody and um, <clears throat> getting the information from them in this case these drawings solely coming from little's memory and from decades ago but Weege says what the killer is tracing now could truly trace his past and solve who these women are. Now we did ask Phoenix police about all of this. They tell us they're still reviewing all of the information the FBI gave to them, but so far they have not been able to corroborate any of it. Seeing Chris, back to you guys. Brianna, thank you.